What up, Guardian Gamers? It's Deeds. Just wanted to give you a heads up. Bungie's mid-season update. There's going to be a weapon archetype that's going to sneak its way up into the meta. And that's going to be the Rapid Fire Fusion Rifles. According to the TWAB from March 30th, Rapid Fire Fusion Rifles uh, are going to get a nice little damage buff um, for, for PvP. Right? So, as Bungie stated, when we last touched Fusion Rifles, Shotguns had seen a big drop in effectiveness, and we were concerned that rapid fire frame fusions would rise up to take their place. As such, we preemptively nerfed rapid fires pretty hard. In today's sandbox, this is less of a concern due to the renewed strength of shotguns following the airborne effectiveness and pellet spread changes. So, we have walked back some of the damage nerfs we made to rapid fires. This change will push them back to defeating all resistance levels in 7 bolts and give them a decent bump to ease of use. Uh, they increase the burst damage by 15, that damage per burst goes from 245 to 260, and damage per bolt goes from 2.72 to 2.89. Uh, damage is not affected in PvP. Right, so this is strictly uh, for PvP. Uh, I've been messing around with the Null Composure. Uh, I really like the Null Composure, has some pretty good stats. Um, has a you know 16 zoom, has uh, high impact reserves. Um, it's void, so it works really well with volatile rounds right now. Um, and then after you know after this update, I'm sure it's gonna be it's gonna be a monster. It's gonna be a beast. Um, one uh, rapid fire to look out for. Um, it's definitely the Cartesian coordinate. I'm not necessarily I'm not necessarily sure if you can still get this, but if you do, the perks you want to look out for are red dot micro. Um, this gives a plus two zoom, so it's going to give uh, Cartesian a 17 zoom, which is very good. Uh, projection fuse, under pressure, high impact reserves, and range masterwork uh, will be the god roll for sure. Um, you know, swashbuckler isn't bad. Um, you now I guess maybe you know Vorpal. You know, if you have everything else, Vorpal might be okay. Um, but one upcoming fusion rifle uh, that pretty sure no one has been necessarily target farming that I think if you really want to get a good rapid fire frame this might be the next best thing and that's the iterative loop from Neo Muna um, the the god roll I think is going to be extended barrel because you get the plus 10 range and you get a plus 10 recoil direction um, obviously projection fuse you want to craft it with uh, enhanced under pressure and enhanced kickstart along with a range masterwork, and then I'd probably throw a counterbalance uh, mod on it uh, to get that recoil direction up to a 72. Um, if extended barrel uh, isn't your go-to, arrowhead break could also be a possibility where you don't get the range, but you get um, an even better recoil direction at 92. This should tighten that bolt spread for sure. Now, how do you get one of these? Um, there are three ways to get an iterative loop. Do terminal overload chests, right? You can get uh, yeah, a iterative loop from heroic patrols and Neo Muna rank up rewards. Uh, you also get one red border uh, iterative loop by playing through the Lightfall campaign. Be sure to use the terminal overload glitch to maximize your RNG. Um, if you know what this is, this is when you can leave the zone and come back, and there's going to be an extra chest. I actually don't know if they patch this or not. Um, so if they didn't patch it, you know, just use that glitch, you can get more chances. Um, heroic patrols are the best way to farm for Neo Muna Red Border weapons uh, in general, so always do those when you see them. Uh, the least productive way to get a iterative loop is through engrams from Nimbus, but it still is possible. Um, after you extract five patterns, then you can craft your own god roll. Thank you for stopping by. Make sure to like, share, and subscribe, and stay tuned for more content. If you like weak ass memes, bad edits, and PvP clips, then this is definitely the place for you. Thank you. Peace.